Once in a while, technology makes a big improvement in user experience, a big leap. And once that happens, there's no going back. Once that happens, the technology becomes pervasive. UWB promised to be such technology. UWB delivers awareness of where an object is relative to you with such level of accuracy that will be the catalyst for new use cases where objects will anticipate our actions. Let me share three reasons why UWB will be widely adopted in the market in the next few years. The first one is UWB delivers spatial awareness, which is a new dimension of information. Knowing where an object is relative to oneself with an accuracy that is currently unmatched by any technology in the market, that delivers location context, and that will unleash use cases not possible today. Objects will react to us, and they will react to other objects based on position, not just distance. Also, spatial awareness is a great companion to security, and it's a great companion to artificial intelligence. And together, they will deliver unprecedented value to consumers. Second one is, UWB adoption will be initially driven by mobile phones. Mobile phone is the most ubiquitous device in the, in the planet, and they play a fundamental and a critical role in the rollout of UWB. Already three tier one smartphone device makers announced UWB and demonstrated UWB in their phones. UWB is shipping today, and this attachment will only continue to increase. Samsung publicly stated that they're working on making UWB a hallmark technology across the broad portfolio products. In addition, automotive is also embracing UWB. Companies like Continental, BMW, Bosch, Volkswagen, they publicly demonstrated UWB in the cars. With secure smart car access as being the reason why they're adopting UWB. The third one, standardization. Standardization is underway. Standardization allows an open ecosystem of devices made by different companies to interoperate with one another. NXP is one of the co-founders of the FIRA Consortium to enable interoperability across chipsets, software, and devices from the beginning. Harnessing the power of the collective industry to promote and to develop UWB through the FIRA Consortium is the fastest way to develop a robust UWB ecosystem. Just after one year, the FIRA Consortium now has over 45 members, among them industry leaders in mobile, industrial, and IoT and automotive, companies like Samsung, Asabloy, Bosch, Cisco, Sony, Xiaomi, Oppo, Hyundai, and many others. Now you can see why we're so excited about UWB and NXP. When we'll put it together, the technical attributes of UWB and this early commercial deployments, it suggests that the technology is ripe for adoption. A technology that will greatly improve the way we interact with smart devices. A technology that will enable these devices to anticipate and automate our daily lives. Thank you.